Good morning everybody and welcome to Excel Made Easy. This is your Excel Guru. Today with a feature called a feature of Excel called number formatting. Number formatting is a very vast topic and it is a very helpful thing. I'll be showing you exactly what can be done with it. So just for example, uh, these are few numbers, dates, currencies I mentioned over here and I'll take you through how to format them so that at your convenience you can do a lot. Alright. Now this number formatting is in the home tab you need to go over here and this is where it is we'll just read a brief about it see shows what does it say show the number tab of the format cell dialog box or this is something else see for example now we happen to have this number mentioned over here we'll I'll just delete it out see I have this number mentioned over here 23 and I would like to show this in the form of currencies so if I want the dollar sign to appear over there I'll directly click over here and see the dollar sign comes up isn't it cool and if we happen to have to choose any other currency then we can choose the font the euro the Chinese yen the French I don't know what they call it franc I believe and such are if you go to more accounting formats you will be able to see the different currencies that are avail available for you to assign a symbol I don't see the INR symbol Indian national rupee recently the Indian national rupee has been given a symbol it's called Ra a nice symbol I don't think that Excel has incorporated it over here uh, it's not there it's not there okay it's okay so this was the currency time now we can also say and I happen to have a number over here I want to give it a format in percentage I just click over here and it will turn into a percentage now you see that this is automatically gone to uh, it has automatically added two zeros over here it was 45 and now it is 4500 percentage so this is something that you need to take care of if you're uh, converting something into percentage a number format into percentage then ensure that the division is done or uh, it's mentioned appropriately like if I wanted it to be for 45 percent I had to be make it like 4.5 and then I would have to click on the percentage sign uh, till again sorry we will have to make it 0.45 and now we can convert it to percentage or simply over here we go to the edit option and we delete two zeros simple as that don't need to spend spend too much brain on it do we <laughs> okay and this was the percentage formula and this is a dollars uh, a, a comma feature very nice thing I'll just uh, just give you an example on this how it works see this is how it works I happen to have a large series of number over here and I would like to if I want to count it then I'll go the way unit tens hundred thousand ten thousand lakh ten lakh crore I do this is the Indian way uh, I don't know how it is done in the US or the UK if somebody can give a comment on that I'll, I love that so if, uh, if you want to just categorize it so this is how we'll do it see it will add commas after every hundred value unit tens hundred comma unit tens hundred comma unit tens hundred comma this is how it goes cool thing and again say I'll take the same example over here now you see this added two decimal points over here sometimes we may choose not to have a decimal point yes we can so this feature if you see it will decrease the decimal point see it's decreasing it easy and this would increase it this one isn't it cool decrease increase this is how it can be done and now I'll move on to other formattings now the first one is general no specific format this would be uh, this would automatically applicable to Excel uh, how it works is if you mention a number it will be on the right hand edge of the cell if you mention if you type in a uh, alphabet it will autom automatically be on the left hand edge of the cell so this is the general formatting now if we go to number formatting again see number formatting 
would take convert it into decimals automatically two decimal points and currency if I click over here I've already shown how it works it will give you a currency symbol over here and the same goes with accounting accounting would add space also over here all right uh, then we go to short date okay for that we have to choose a date say for example uh, I take in this date over here I write in today's date see how I'll mention the date <laughs> I pressed colon and control at the same time I was able to get the date and so now I want this is a short date all right so this is a long date now let's see how does Excel take it now this is a short date now I this was a long date earlier and it's now converted to a short date I'll get it back to a long date see I'll get it to a long date again this one now I'll get it to a short date see then there is time time is never there <laughs> okay I have already mentioned the time over here if you see and if I click over here it will take it to this format time format wherein the AM PM is also mentioned let me show you a cool trick uh, how to get the immediate system time on your Excel just type just do control shift colon and you'll get the time and if I want to convert it to a long time as it says long time uh, just click over here and time and this is again percentage we have already covered it you this will convert it to fractions this is something scientific I am not a geek won't be able to get into this and this is text which I've already covered so this is the number formatting a very good feature a very good feature and it can be used in so many ways it can work on cells it can work on ranges it can work on uh, on the complete workbooks and worksheets and this sheet is available for download on my website excelmadeeasy.weebly.com yes uh, you have to go to the training files page and there you will be able to find it uh, and this is my YouTube oh there's some error okay temporary this is my YouTube playlist for my Western customers uh, for my sorry, customers I'm using the word customer so sorry it's just my different line of business where I get used to using those words uh, uh, this is for my West uh, the my viewers in the Western Hemisphere where English is more prevalent and this is for my cust my my patrons and my friends my viewers in the Indian and the Asian region especially in India and Pakistan thank you so much Pakistan I see a lot of videos coming in from there and this is my Twitter link my Facebook link do do like me like my work if you believe it's something that can that's helping so these are just click on the like button and it will take you to my YouTube my Facebook page and this is my Facebook page if you go over there you can like us over there and help me in spreading education this is my YouTube channel you can view all my videos over here as of now I have 36 videos I have two playlists one is in English and one is in Hindi and yes you can subscribe over here just click on subscribe sign in or sign up if you happen to have a YouTube ID or a Google ID for that case you can just sign in or you can sign up this is totally free this will allow you to be uh, for this will allow YouTube to send you updates regarding whenever a new update is added by me uh, a new video is added by me uh, I would like to thank thank these five subscribers uh, a few are from India a few are from UK one is from US a couple of them from India a couple of them from US one from UK so thank you to all those guys and yes so do continue uh, your feedback do provide your feedback so this is your excel guru signing off for the day have a wonderful day goodbye